Bridgerton. Jump Page! Oh, wow. Page. I mean, I mentioned Bridgerton. I guess what's weird is you're in the biggest show in the world, you're a global superstar, but you're presumably <laughs> just telling your fridge you're opening. <laughs> yeah, it's just me and it's me and the four walls and my cushions, <laughs> my exceedingly bad cushions that all my friends tell me off for. <laughs> but has the postman been impressed to find Reggae Jean Page behind a door? Or... Um, no, because I don't go to the door because I'm scared of the postie and the <laughs> tabloids and bits. That's the only bit that's real about the global superstar. Oh, so superstar you don't know what's bit. out there? Yeah, you don't know who's behind the door. Lockdown has ended about three months ago. <laughs> <laughs> And this yeah. is why we don't think. Yeah. You didn't tell me. Yeah. You didn't tell me at all. All delighted to see you, Dave. Yeah. But I don't know if you're watching Bridgerton, but uh, Reggae Jean Page, you are, you, I mean, you are proper Foo Fighters. I, I'm hugely relieved you're not in the studio. I wouldn't be functional if you were. Um, but it's a pleasure <laughs> to meet you at a distance, sir. <laughs> no, because didn't didn't you, didn't didn't you learn to play you're, the drums? You're you're pretty much the reason I'm a performer entirely. The first song I learned to play on drums was Learn to Fly. Um, my brother and I would terrorise my neighbours with this on loop. We'd play it at like all of our local church halls, like just because I think we've got a picture of you, Reggae, in your in your band. Here you are. Look at you. <laughs> Look at you. So wow. cool. That's that's what you did, Dave. You built this. Yeah. You built that. <laughs> Don't put that on me. Don't put that on me. <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. At least one of the lonely dudes dancing in his underwear in his kitchen will be me. And so this lonely dude is You can make that program yeah. happen, you know? Talk to my people. Yeah, you've got some dancing. <laughs> Great. I mean, you are a proper... Huge fan. Yeah. I mean, all I want to know is whether he recorded the scream when they put the ankle back in, because <laughs> I want to hear that on the record. I think that'd be brilliant. Oh. <laughs> it's so uh, now, uh, Reggie Jean Page is the Duke of Hastings in Bridgerton. It's streaming now on Netflix, and, I mean, this thing is... a global phenomenon, 82 million households. So I hear. If someone isn't a member of one of those 82 million <laughs> households, uh, tell us what it's about. Ah, uh, it's <laughs> the period dramas you know and love, but not as you know them. It's faster, wittier, funnier, sexier, considerably sexier. Um, very glamorous uh, and just unashamed of its own joy. And so it's kind of, we did our best to kind of subvert the things that you think you know about period dramas and let you have a bit more fun with them because we all need a bit of fun at the moment. And this comes from that kind of incredible Shonda Rhimes world, Shondaland, mm. which you were in Shonda world, Shondaland already. Yes. Uh, I've been working in, uh, for Shonda for the last three years before Bridgerton in a show called For the People. I've been doing a New York lawyer. I've been doing my best kind of fast talking, high trouser type of acting. Um, <laughs> And Shonda didn't actually know that I was British when they were casting Bridgerton. She was just like, I want what he was doing in that show, but British. And then I turned up and we had our meeting. She was like, wait, you're, you're not American. I was like, no, no, this is actually what I do. You'll be the first person to allow me to act in my own accent for about six years. Oh, um, oh. Which was lovely, wow. and I appreciate that very much. It was, it was great. Not quite my own accent. I'm a little bit more common. Than so, the... so wait, yes, you are a little bit, Daniel. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, but <laughs> <laughs> I was a bit disappointed. I was like, oh, right. I mean, I can't oh. Run it back. It's just it's a lot of effort. Oh, very, very good. And of course, the two of you uh, who share a castmate, Nicola. Yes. We do. Yes. Yes, lovely Nicola. Yeah, yeah. And of course, that's why I started watching. Uh, Bridgerton, it's uh, and you're one of the reasons I stopped watching it. I do my best. Yeah, <laughs> actually, because I live alone and and there's a <laughs> pandemic going on and just watching very beautiful people have a lovely time dancing and having sex. I'm like, you know, I don't want to watch that. <laughs> Crying, eating beans in my pants. <laughs> Another episode. I hate myself. <laughs> ah! I'll, I'll just eat a radish. Oh, but look. <laughs> Just so that we brought the heat, we set the fire yeah, off. As you're acting overheated the studio. <laughs> I know, it's just gone up in flames. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I mean, yeah. Reggie's used to this. He walks into shops. Time. He walks into shops, the fire alarm goes off. <laughs> this is why I don't do the voice. Just, yeah. I knew I shouldn't have done it. <laughs> yeah. That's why it doesn't open the door, because it'll probably be the fire brigade. <laughs> when we heard about Richard, we were promised it was going to be uh, like this you know, really raunchy sex. And I was watching it. I thought, where is the sex? But my God, once you pull the <laughs> ripcord, it's it's non-stop. There's a bit. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, even you must have been kind of you know at the table read. You must have been going blah 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 blah. I haven't spoken for pages. <laughs> <laughs> well, I got my mouth full half the time. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Which I was insisting on, because I think that's important to see on TV as well, because yes. I think you, that is uncommon that you see that kind of power dynamic in raunchy scenes, and that's part of the way that we did want to modernise the show. So the Duke does have his mouth full, and he's proud of it. Um, <laughs> but yes, there was, there was a fair bit um, to be done on the show. Because you're really going for it, but you're going for it in kind of beautiful locations. It's, oh, yeah. 
I mean, like... And occasionally I, very uncomfortable occasions. Well, yeah, those library steps didn't look easy. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, the but but didn't, you have, didn't you have room <laughs> monitors in the stately homes? Well, this is the problem, because the set, as usual, is more valuable than any of the actors. So if you're in, like, you know, a 200-year-old <laughs> bed or a 400-year-old four-poster, um, it has to have a minder. Like, you know, when, some, when people kind of bring very expensive jewellery around and they have to have a, a bodyguard yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a bodyguard for the room. And so at all times, you know, you've got this minimal set, everyone gets very quiet, very respectful, and you kind of, you derobe and you hit the bed. And then there's also just like Fran in the corner, who's just standing there just kind of deciding whether or not to look. She's like, I have to look. I'm not allowed to look. I have to look. <laughs> could, you, could, could you please go easy on the bed? It's very, very old. <laughs> it's not quite so enthusiastic. Oh, oh, do go on. That's, that's, that's the inner monologue that I imagine <laughs> is going on in the corner of the room. Yeah, I'll stop them in a minute. <laughs> <laughs> and presumably you had to have the awkward kind of family conversation before? Yeah, a little bit. Um, I mean, we've got a family WhatsApp group, so there's a couple of, you know, flashing red light emojis and <laughs> the odd peach emoji. Um, certain people have threatened to rate my peach. Um, but <laughs> we missed a couple of family members, and so people do enjoy the fact that, like, a couple of cousins missed the memo. Um, and so they're watching the show, and I got a very stern message in my, in my Instagram DMs, oddly enough, just going, I, you, there really needs to be a cousin warming. I had to make so many tactical cups of tea. <laughs> and I left the room and made my tactical cup of tea and came back, and you were still going! <laughs> so you had to start doing pots of tea. You know, you had to kind of, kind of keep building up the... <laughs> Every course the meal, a tasting menu, if you will. <laughs> Absolutely. Do you feel awkward during sex scenes? Um, no, not really. Not when they're done right. Because the, right. You know, this is, we've talked a lot about our wonderful intimacy coordinator. Yeah. So yeah. it's scripted, just like a dramatic scene, except physically scripted. So you know where your hands are going to be, you know whose hands going to be where, at what point, how you react to that. It's literally just choreography, at which point... It you takes get the, the embarrassment out of it, I suppose. Yeah, it? it takes the embarrassment out. It also takes the risk out, because also that you can... It's like d choreographing a fight scene. You can, yeah. you can do damage if you're not careful with your co-stars. Co yeah. Did you look at that is, photo when, my, when the screen froze of me on Good Morning Britain? Did you use that, <laughs> maybe, um, as I inspiration? thought that was your audition. <laughs> I thought that was, that was your audition. I was about to call up the producers and say, have you seen that? We've got an expert. <laughs> <laughs> you could be the intimacy coach. <laughs> I I'm pretty sure I make that face a couple of times, to be fair. <laughs> Mum sends her love. Uh, tell and her so I send my love the right back. The rest of the world. Uh, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> that's going to happen. Now you're leaving the house. That's going to happen a lot. <laughs> <laughs> my cabbie on the way over, way over was the same. I thought I was safe. I thought I was in a mask. And he was like, and I was like, oh, I'm going to have to explain. It's got my publicist's name. He was like, oh no, I recognise you a mile off. Those eyebrows, mate. Not a chance. <laughs> my wife loves you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but now.